Hello friends, welcome to Suresh Agarwal's Mathematics Shortcuts. Very recently, I started a series of videos for my class six students. And you know, class six, seventh and eight mathematics, it forms the base of all the quantitative aptitude topics. So if you are aware about the basic topics which are included in class six syllabus, then I think you can form a very good foundation for all those quantitative aptitude exams, including the school exams like RMO and then uh, the NTSC, the Aryabhat Ganit Challenge uh, launched by CBSC. And then um, at professional level, you have SSC, CGL, IBPS, LIC, AAO, and then Railways Banking. You know, so many exams in which quantitative aptitude is involved. And that's why I have bought up this series of videos in which you can learn the topics right from the basics. The first chapter of class six is right now going on. And that chapter is knowing our numbers. So I have already launched one video and uh, you have greatly appreciated that. And everybody was like, uh, you know, the PDF which I shared on the links which I have given in the description box below. You know, those PDFs are like a gem. Why? Because you won't find a better collection on the internet. It's a huge collection of questions. You find four or five questions uh, related to a particular concept, right? wherever you find them, whether on internet or uh, in the print form in any book. But what if you have, if you can practice 50 to 60 questions based on a single concept in a single PDF and that to the pricing being in single digits. Amazing, right? That's what is the aim of this channel now. And uh, in this video, I'm going to take up the second lecture of my class six uh, topics that is knowing our numbers. That's the chapter number one. So what's the topic? The placement boxes and the expanded form of numbers. Now this is the topic and uh, you know, I keep on telling to my friends the ebook of short tricks and the reasoning courses, you know, so many things we have already launched on this on the channel. And now this series of uh, PDFs for my class six students and all for all competitions, you know, you, if you are preparing for any competition, you have to prepare from the basics, go for this. It, it will not hurt your pocket also and uh, you know this is worksheet number two expanded form and ordering of numbers uh, the link i have already posted in the description box below and if for some reason uh, you are not able to get through the transaction on uh, the website then you can send me a message on whatsapp 9896369963 amazing pdf try one i am sure you are going to have a treasure of all those pdfs which we are going to launch in subsequent time so friends let's have the topic for today look at this number 69531052 you know in class 6 uh, when the numbers are like seven digit eight digit nine digit that's the time students start feeling a little bit scared of numbers you know and that's the time when we have to tell them these are the basic things you need to keep in mind when you are handling these numbers so placement boxes look at the number uh, i have already solved it for you just to save time um, and uh, you know you can draw them yourself when you uh, download that practice pdf so from the right hand side o stands for ones t stands for tens and h stands for hundreds so ones tens and hundreds up to here the students are like very very comfortable they know after that you know you have to learn the placement boxes in pairs so th is thousands and then we prefix a t with th so that becomes tth and that t which has been prefixed that means 10 so 10 thousands and then again a pair l and tl l is lakh so tl is 10 lakh and similarly the pair here this is CR means crores and this is TCR which means 10 crore. So this is the Indian system of uh, numeration to, uh, which has been described in these placement boxes. Uh, OTH from the right hand side, ones, tens and hundreds. And after that, learn in pairs, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, ten lakh, crore, ten crore. I hope that is not a problem for you now. Now, how far we have to write the placement boxes we have to write the placement boxes up to see how many boxes 
how many digits are there in the given number? Let's count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we have to write 9 placement boxes and that's what we have done there. And then you can just write the number in the serial order there 6, 9, 5, 3, 1, 0, 5, 2, 8. And now I know that 10 crore, 10 crore is 1 followed by 8 zeros, right? So whatever number we have written here, 6, that will be multiplied by 10 crore. And then remember to put the plus sign always. Then next digit is 9. And now keep on reducing 1, 0 when you write the second box, the expanded form of the second box. So 9 times 1 crore plus then we have the 5. So 5 times 10 lakh. And then 3 times 1 lakh plus 1 times 10,000 and then 0 times. See, if you write 0 times 1,000, it doesn't matter even if you omit this, you don't write this. But for once, for my class 6 students, I tell you, you can write it once and in the next step, ignore this so that you don't have to write 0 times 1,000. 0 times anything is 0, right? So you don't need to write it. But I have written it so that you can avoid the confusion that you have to miss out on one followed by three zeros there. And then hundreds, this is obvious, five times hundred is 500 and then two times 10 is 20 and eight times one is eight itself. So here is the expanded notation of this number. Such a resourceful PDF, you know, we have been working so hard creating all those PDFs for my students there class 6 students and all the competitive exams you know yeah if you have a treasure of such questions at one place you don't need to look left and right right when you complete all those pdfs so uh, practicing all those pdfs and moreover there the answer key is also provided with the pdfs for ready reference so that you don't get stuck anywhere so this is the first concept the placement box concept let's have the second concept now the second concept is when you have to write the number in the expanded form. Now, this is where the students falter. So, we have uh, or you can write the numeral value of an expanded form which is given to you. Suppose I give you 30907. So, you should know that this is 1, tens, hundreds, thousands and ten thousands. So, you know that this is 3 times 10,000. So, that is 30,000. Okay, so 3 and 0, I think this can be combined. Why? Because the thousands are 30 here, 30 thousands. So if you expand this, you will write it as 30 thousand. And then the next digit, 9. 9 is in the hundreds place. So you will write 900, 900. And finally, zero tens you don't need to write zero tens in the expanded form and then seven so that becomes the number name now this is the other way around when you have when you are writing the number name now how do you write the numeral from the given number name this, this is something important and this is what we have demonstrated there you look at this six lakh seventy thousand one hundred one now six lakh seventy thousand one hundred one if you write the placement boxes then look at the number of digits we will have 101 so ones tens hundreds 6 lakh it starts with 6 lakh 70 thousand 6 lakh 6 digits so we will write up to thousand ten thousand and lakhs and then we will write 6 lakh 70 thousand one hundred and one look at the number now numeral 670101. So I hope you understand how and how far you have to write the placement boxes and how do you use the placement boxes to find the numeral for a particular expanded form. You can see one more example I have given there. The example is 45 lakh, 45 lakh. So for me, this is seven digits. Why? Because 45 lakhs, if it is a single digit, like the, in the example given above, 6 lakh, it is 6 digits. 45 lakhs, now it is 7 digits. 
and when you have seven digits you have to write up to up to what 10 lakhs so the placement boxes will come up to 10 lakhs now 45 lakh so four five here we have the answer four five 75,000 so again a two digit thousands 75,000 and then very simple 305 so 305 is the suffix that means the last part of the answer remember to put the commas wherever required commas are very very essential in indian system of numeration and that's why this video of uh, you know ordering and uh, expanded forms and uh, these placement boxes assumes importance basics are the ones in which the students struggle you know the millions the billions those are the things which uh, the students get often confused with and uh, you know if, if you can get confused in that obviously when you build on those concepts at higher level the the problem will uh, only aggravate so friends an amazing video for you and the pdf is waiting for you the pdf the link description is given in the description box below click that and the price of that pdf you know you will be surprised you know you can count the price on the fingers that's what i can say so very affordable and everybody can practice like 60 questions based on a single concept in that pdf along with the answer key such a huge effort has gone into the making of those pdfs exclusive pdfs you will not find a better collection anywhere on the internet so friends uh, i hope you will visit this website www.sureshagarwal.in uh, obviously the link is given in the description so you don't need to remember the name of the website and if you, somehow if you don't uh, uh, if you can't download through that whatsapp 9896369963 to get a copy of that amazing pdf do share this video do, do like this video and share it with your whatsapp groups so that all the school students can be benefited and uh, do subscribe this channel uh, click the bell shaped icon for getting the notifications thanks for watching this video and all the best